So, as I said in my previous video, I had seen the show on the 26th of May, but I have also seen it on the 27th of May. And honestly, the 27th of May was a much more relaxing experience. Uh, I had a normal amount of sleep and um, then we first had an Avatalk meetup. So I got to meet a lot of fans. It was much fun um i was uh we were eating and we were dancing a bit and singing a bit and talking a bit um we're fans from all different countries there was even one guy that recognized me from my youtube video so that was fun um and yeah and then we went to the show again um this time um we met um two other fans from our age and uh, we were a bit more in the middle instead of in the back compared to the night before and um, I think it was nice to be in the middle because people were even more energetic than in the back uh, so that was very nice um, and then yeah, it was it was very I was very happy that I got a chance to see the show again because it was a different experience. I was not as tired as the night before and there was not a guy getting unwell so I could see the whole show and still it looked just as real as the first time even though they were of course doing the exact same thing uh, and I was not distracted by looking at Ava all the time behind me. Um, and later I saw on Facebook that Benny and Bjorn had been in the audience as well, the 27th, so that was cool. <laughs> but I hadn't seen them. I was now, this time, I was just only looking at the front, at the stage in front of me. And I had a great time. We were dancing and singing and, um, yeah. And um, I was also uh, looking at the people around me and I was... Uh, in contact with them and uh, we were really experienced this thing together so that was really nice and um, then when the new songs came on so don't shut me down and um, I still have faith in you I <laughs> teared up again um, and the night before I had kind of missed those songs because I was being concerned about the guy being unwell um but now i could really have a look at it and um i was amazed by the fact that um that the new vocals matched so well with the 70s image of abba because i thought there would be a mismatch between um how they sounded and how it looked but somehow my brain made it work and there wasn't a mis mismatch at all so that was actually really great to experience so then I kind of got the feeling, oh wow, I am looking at a new ABBA song performed live. How I had never expected to witness that. So that made me tear up. And <laughs> by the time I still have faith in you came on, I was I was crying <laughs> like a baby. <laughs> I feel a bit ashamed of that, but I think um I think that might have been the idea of the producers to evoke the emotions so I can say that they managed to do that in me uh, at least um, and yeah but at the end of the show I did feel a bit sad that uh, well I was very happy of course but also I had this mixed feeling of well now the real Ebba is uh, well is is done is is ready and uh, this is it well this is it that's a bit disrespectful to say because this thing is amazing but like the feeling of it being over after after having such a period with so much going on around abba and now you have seen the show and now i didn't expect to see this a few songs another time but i will talk about that in my next video um so, yeah, it was uh, it was very nice to see it again, and the second show was just an as great as experience as the 
it's the first show. And then at the end, I think people were hoping for Abba to come on stage, um, but they didn't. Um, so that was okay, I'd seen them the night before. Um, but if I would have missed the premiere, I would be quite sad. But I didn't miss the premiere, so yeah, it was amazing. The second night was just as amazing as the first night. I mean, the show, it's, it's great. It's awesome. <laughs> Oh yeah, and one other thing I want to say about the second night, which made it much better, is that I was wearing earplugs. Because the first night, everything sounded one pitch higher from a certain moment on, because my ears just stopped working properly. But the second night I had earplugs and it made it sound so much better. So if you're going to watch a show, just take earplugs and uh, it will make it much better, I promise.